The scientific theory of the creation of the world, as mentioned earlier, is known as the Big Bang Theory. According to this theory, the universe started as a single, infinitely dense point known as a singularity. The singularity then underwent a rapid expansion, which is commonly referred to as the Big Bang, approximately 13,8 billion years ago. The universe continued to expand and cool down, and as it did, particles such as protons and neutrons formed. These particles eventually combined to form the first atoms, mostly hydrogen and helium. As the universe continued to expand and cool, gravity caused clouds of gas and dust to come together and form stars and galaxies. Stars are essentially giant nuclear reactors that produce light and heat through the process of nuclear fusion. Some of these stars eventually exploded, sending their material out into space and forming new stars and planets. On Earth, the formation of the planet is believed to have occurred through a process called accretion. This process involves the gradual accumulation of matter, such as dust and gas, into larger and larger objects. Over time, these objects collided and merged to form the planets of the solar system. In contrast, religious beliefs about the creation of the world are often rooted in sacred texts and stories. For example, the Judeo-Christian creation story in the book of Genesis describes the creation of the world by God in six days. Other religious traditions have their own creation stories, often involving the actions of gods or other supernatural beings. It's important to note that scientific theories and religious beliefs about the creation of the world can coexist and complement each other. While scientific theories are based on evidence and observation, religious beliefs are often based on faith and interpretation of sacred texts. Many people find ways to reconcile the two in their personal worldview. Write your questions in the comments. See you in the next video.